Yo, what is up, FTF fam? Thank you so much for tuning in to yet another episode of Fat to Fit. My name is Mike Austin, and today I got a lot of explaining to do for you guys, man. I have been gone for at least two and a half or three months, but I'm telling you guys right now that I'm coming back with constant content for Fat to Fit, man. Um, and right now, I'm actually at the gym, gonna train legs with a very special guest today. I'm not gonna say who it is just yet, but you'll see him very, very soon in this video, man. But I do wanna express the fact that, you know, I have been gone, I have been inconsistent. And the reason for that has basically just been um, the depression came back, man. The anxiety, the second guessing myself, the you know, just like self-doubt, man, and not really taking care of myself. Um, but for the past month or so, uh, I've definitely been like um, getting back into the gym, getting back into the routine and everything like that, man. And I cannot wait to create more and more content for you guys. The body transformation is coming very soon. I promise you that. But stay tuned for the rest of this video. You don't want to miss out. So, welcome back. Um, during the break, I decided to warm up a little bit. Um, 100 jump ropes, uh, high knees, um, and like some other kind of like leg exercises. Like when you swing your leg back and forth. I'm not, I'm not sure what it's called, but uh, basically warming up for leg day. I'm about to go inside, do the first exercise, uh, barbell squats, and that is also where we're gonna meet uh, our special guest for today's video. So, stay tuned for that. guys so i'm taking the vlog back outside uh i'm gonna do some deadlifts i was gonna do them inside but somebody was using like uh the, like the little area to do deadlifts for some reason there's only one area for deadlifts i think that's kind of strange so i took it outside uh gonna improvise out here um and just get it done uh my special guest is still doing his own workout routine i don't want to interrupt him but I assure you guys, man, I'm gonna sit down with him. We're gonna talk, um, and I'm gonna int introduce you guys uh, to this special guest, man. It's gonna be really cool. <sighs> One thing I like about this gym that I'm at right now, um, it's very quiet very open area um, as you can see I'm on like this gigantic turf field I'm the only person that's out here right now um, and everybody that goes to the gym is actually like in pretty decent shape so it's definitely um, motivating to see that you're in an environment where like everybody's just like trying to do better for themselves and um, trying to take care of themselves and live like that healthy lifestyle and everything but I really do like this gym uh, for some of you guys that don't know I actually am in Orlando Florida right now I'm no longer in Maryland uh, currently um, but yeah man uh, I'm gonna see what's going on with this guy man because I really want you guys to meet him but you know I know he's got his own thing going on right now but I really 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 want you guys to meet him so uh, I'm gonna see what's going on with him and I'll be back soon so I finally caught this guy in between sets man ladies and gentlemen may I introduce the man the myth the legend himself Austin oh. hey yo, yo what what's up what's <laughs> up guys AD team in the house, you already know what we're doing. You already Begging know, these gains out here. Athletic Apex, Florida. How's your workout, Mike? Uh, it was good, man. Uh, usually, uh, I usually try to like jump in with Austin and train with him, but today I kind of wanted to do uh, my own thing. My workout was like really, really intense, even though it was like uh, uh, low reps, but it was very high intensity, so I definitely enjoyed that a lot, man. Mm -hmm. Caught this guy, finally. I wanted to get him in the video way, way earlier, but he yeah. was doing his own thing. I didn't want to interrupt you and stuff. It's all good. Um, but yeah, man, uh, we're definitely gonna talk to Austin a little more later on today. Right now, my battery's dying, so I gotta cut the vlog right now, but I'll be back in just a few seconds. All right, guys, so back from the gym. Uh, I showered, got cleaned up, 
Um, and right now I'm about to make some food. I was gonna have like a small little like interview session with Austin, but he's actually like extremely busy today and has a lot of things to handle, a lot of things to take care of. So we'll do that in a separate video. However, I wanna take some time right now to just explain like why I've been gone, what happened um, in as much detail as possible uh, of just like, like why I disappeared, man, because I've been gone for about, two and a half, almost three months of just like not posting uh, fat to fit videos on YouTube. I have been very active on my Instagram, so definitely follow me on Instagram, at Mike Alston. Let me get straight into this explanation of why I've been gone. So like I said, um, pretty much story time right now. Um, I do wanna tell you guys exactly, uh, in as much detail as possible, exactly why I've been absent and what's been going on. Um, some tea is definitely uh, gonna be spilled. Not a lot, just just a little bit, just a little splash, man. But uh, some tea is definitely gonna get spilled today um, of just like what's happening uh, and what has, like what had happened. Um, none of this is like an excuse. None of this is like, oh, have pity on me and sympathy and stuff like that. That's not at all what I'm going for. I'm just, you know, going for, uh, you know, for you guys to understand exactly why I've been gone. A lot has changed in my life. Um, no, like, it's like good and bad things. Like I moved to a new city. I live in Orlando now uh, with Austin. Um, so it's not just like, I just randomly saw him at the gym. Like he and I are actually very, very good friends. We live together, like kind of like a roommate style, even though he's technically my boss. Um, but I'll talk more about that later. Um, basically it's like life, you know, Life throws curveballs at you, you know what I'm saying? Like you never um, see adversity coming your way. You never see bad things uh, happening before they unfold. Um, and I just had like a lot of family drama, man. I had drama with uh, my cousins. Uh, my grandmother is sick with dementia. Um, I've recently just gone through a, a breakup, a pretty messy breakup actually. Um, and what had happened with my cousins, uh, the two cousins, a boy and a girl, had to break that up everybody had to choose sides um and it, it just caused like a lot of emotional and mental stress as well as you know my grandmother being sick my grandmother's in her late 70s so getting sick is not ideal um and that's not something that anybody would want to deal with um especially a grandchild or even like um her own children like my mom my aunts my uncles and stuff like that um, and then also going through my breakup, which was actually like a few weeks ago from the time that I'm recording this video, it was like two or three weeks ago that I went through this breakup. Um, very, very messy situation, very confusing situation. And all of that just deterred me from working out. All of that, like, I just let it sit there, you know? I didn't uh, use the gym as therapy as I normally do. I didn't um, confide in anybody. I kind of just like, uh, put the weight on my own shoulders and you know uh, tried to handle things on my own but couldn't um, my personal brand 333 studios was my photography and lifestyle brand um, was falling apart uh, a lot of the success that I had in the beginning of 2018 slowly declined uh, when 2019 came around and right now I'm actually in the process of uh, building it back up so it's just like so many things have happened that working out just had to be put uh, uh, on the back, in, like in the back, like on the back burner, in the back seat, stuff like that. But um, what I'm really, I guess the point that I'm really trying to make is that, you know, when I realized the impact that I was starting to have on people with fat to fit specifically beginners uh, in working out in general, not just calisthenics, not just weightlifting. Um, when I started to realize my impact, um, you know, I was like, dang, man, like, I really, like, let people down. I really, I felt like I let you guys down. I felt like I let myself down. Um, and a lot of people in my personal life were like, dang, Mike, like, what happened, bro? Like, what's going on, man? Like, we were rooting for you, you know, we were counting on you, you know? Um, and I really just felt bad because I'm, you know, I'm letting uh, my own personal uh, uh, feelings and my own personal uh, drama get in the way of my goals you know i started eating terribly again i you know obviously wasn't working out i wasn't going to the gym so a lot of the weight that i had lost i had gained some of it back and i didn't gain a full 40 50 pounds i gained about 15 20 pounds um right back to the stomach hanging over my waistline um and honestly right back at square one actually today 
uh, today is October 25th. Actually, today was actually my first day back uh, doing my own workouts. Um, and I felt and I felt really, really good about that, man. And, you know, it was a great workout. It was an exhausting workout, workout which I love. Um, but I just felt like, you, you know, I, that you guys deserve more and I need to do more. And, you know, no one else is making videos like these. No one else is, you know, uh, putting out the message like I'm trying to put the message out. Like somebody needs to hear that somebody is counting on this. I get so many DMs on Instagram about how, you know, people are inspired and motivated when they watch both my videos on YouTube and Instagram. Um, I open my Instagram up a lot in my story for questions that people have all these incredible, nice, inspiring things to say. And I just felt terrible because I'm like, wow, man, like you think that highly of little old me and I'm not even putting my best foot forward. And I just feel like you guys deserve uh, more than that, especially now that I've realized that I am building an influence and I didn't even realize I was building an influence. Um, yeah, you guys just deserve more, man. So Fat to Fit's coming back every single Friday. Um, every single Friday, man. Fat to Fit Fridays. Um, but yeah, you guys deserve more. Uh, I'm gonna give you more. You guys deserve better. I'm gonna be better. Um, so yeah, uh, <laughs> uh, thank you for tuning into my TED Talk. Uh, this was this was fun, man. This is really, really fun. Today's vlog, um, though, was like kind of short. Uh, as far as like the workout segment, as far as me recording, my workout was actually about an hour and a half long. Um, but though the workout was short, man, I promise, I promise, I promise, man, Fat to Fit is coming back. Um, Fat to Fit's gonna be better than ever. And we just got a lot of content coming your way, both for Michael Alston and 333 Studios. So stay on the lookout for that. Um, honestly, man, I truly, honestly love you guys man uh, you guys keep me grounded you guys keep me motivated um so please like keep commenting all these great things keep dming me man keep sending me all these uh these wonderful and inspirational messages um because that is what's gonna basically fuel the fire you know what i'm saying um but yeah if you like this video uh be sure to leave that thumbs up as always man if you're brand new to this channel be sure to subscribe share this video with a friend or multiple friends if you think that they would enjoy this fact to fit series and i will see you guys in the next episode